Hi, guys. Sue, where are you? Sue! Sue! I'm here, and I'm ready to work. I prepared everything we need for the craft. Awesome. So let's get started. Let's put these parts aside. We'll need them later. Oh, <laughs> I forgot to say hi. Hello, dear viewers. First of all, let me remind you to be careful while working with hot glue. By the way, I don't really know if Sam told you what we're making. <laughs> I'll tell you this secret. It's not a secret. I'm gonna tell myself. This will be a machine for space missions. Requesting permission to land. We'll cruise across the universe far away from our planet and find a system where only slimes live. Uh, Sam, are you sure about that? What do you mean? We're making a coin sorting machine. I'm gluing the walls for it now. Yeah? Oh, I confused it with my secret craft. What secret craft? Huh? Come on, Sammy. Spit it out. Uh, I wanted to make a rocket. Well, whatever. Ladies and gentlemen, behold! We're making a brand new sorting machine for... coins! <laughs> Bravo, Sammy. Great performance. You think so? Sure. By the way, this is how our coins will be sorted. Each coin will fall into the slot of the right size. There. See? By the way, how are you controlling those coins? It's magic! Oh, all right, fine. Let it be magic. You were also talking about a rocket. Have you prepared something for it? Of course. Stay here. I'm gonna show you what I got. I'm not going anywhere. We're actually making a craft here. And I am curious to see what Sam can make. Oh, no, I want to rock it too. But I'll try to limit myself to this machine. Plus, we're moving to a very interesting part. The motor. So let's connect the motor wires to the dimmer. It will help control the speed of the motor. Now let's attach the contact block for the battery. There we go. Connect the motor to the battery to make it work. Be very careful with wires, guys. Ask an adult to help you. Sam, how much longer? Almost there. Okay, okay, I'm waiting. Sam will launch the rocket. <gasps> Sam, is everything okay? Oh no, the test run failed. I guess it's lack of funding. Finish the coin machine, Sue, so I can buy new materials. <sighs> Naughty slime. I'm going back to work. Uh, you can keep this. I made this plate out of Sam's rocket piece that he kindly gave to me. The notches should be as large as the biggest coin you've got. Now we need to attach the plate to the motor axle. Glue it really well and secure it with another cardboard piece. There. Sam ran away so quickly that I didn't have time to ask anything. I wonder what happened to his rocket. Give a thumbs up if you want to find out too. But I think neither Sam nor his morale were hurt. Actually, I think he's trying to fool me. Anyway, let's glue the front part of our machine. Huh, what went wrong? Maybe the engine power wasn't strong enough? Ugh, I'm gonna check on Sue. I'm here to get away from my calculations. Do you need help? You can cut transparent plastic into pieces. What plastic? Challenge accepted, Susan. All right, plastic. It can reduce the rocket weight. Thanks, Sue. Uh, you're welcome. <laughs> I need to think if I said something wrong. Even if Sam says thinking can cause a headache, he's an expert in this, so I'll follow his advice. Now set the controller and apply some glue here. Be very careful. It's hot. Sue, I noticed one flaw in your design. Yeah? What is it? How will you take the battery out when it dies? Oh, through this hatch. But how? When did you make it? Magic, Sammy. Magic. <laughs> okay, you got me. I'm gonna go finish my rocket. Guys, subscribe to our channel if you love craft magic! Now we're going to make shoots for the coins. Let's get started. 
We need to use the right measurement for each shoot. Glue the sidewalls, making sure a coin can pass between them. We'll have four types of coins. That means we need four different shoots. Two, I was passing by and saw some pieces. I decided to glue them. Oh, thank you. Do they have different sizes? Sure, one per each coin type. Cool, and uh, what about plastic? Oh, I forgot, I'm off. Oh, Sammy, Sammy. Sammy what, I've got this thing on my mind now. Oh, what kind of thing? Why do I make the helmet from? How do I breathe in open space? Oh, got it. Be right back. <laughs> you look cool, Sammy. You bet. The best designer worked on that helmet. Uh, I think the designer is Sam himself. Give a thumbs up if you agree with me. Oh, do you want to make more helmets? Yeah, for my fingers. <laughs> well, fingers need protection, too. Oh, Sam, stop making me laugh. These will be the containers for the coins. Ah, so let me help you. I can glue the rest. It'll be great. By the way, how's it going with the rocket? Almost done. You'll see. Oh, I can't wait. I hope this time it'll be safer. Sure, this time everything's gonna be fine. By the way, here's your help. Containers for the coins. <laughs> Thanks for your help, Sammy. So, don't you think this machine's a bit brave? Yes, I do. That's why I'm going to decorate it. Here goes the roof. Something like a chimney. Stickers to mark the coin value. Also, let's add some color to the central piece. with the sorting machine, but I still haven't seen your rocket. I need a few minutes more. It's gonna be ready soon. isn't real and so can the viewers. Of course, it's a prototype. I decided not to risk anymore. I promise it would be safe, remember? <sighs> yeah, can't argue with that. Well, I think we need to invest more coins into rocket development. You can just give me um, these two stacks. Okay, okay. But I wanted to spend them on sweets. Sweets? Uh, the rocket can wait, but the sweets cannot. Come on, let's go buy something. Cosmically yummy! <laughs> Someone's changed his tune. I brought more coins from my stash, too. But Sam, that's our shared jar. We both put coins in it. You only put quarters and I put different coins. <sighs> yeah, but only just a few. Fine, just don't get distracted. Check out how many we've got. Time to count the coins. All right, but first we need to say bye to the viewers. Yes. Bye-bye, guys. Subscribe to our channel and give a thumbs up. And share this video with your friends. See ya. Hi, guys. Today, we're going to make a coin sorting machine. From metal? Uh, no. From plastic? No, Sammy. From cardboard. But a real vending machine isn't made of cardboard. Yes, sure, but it's not that important to understand how it works. Uh, well, fine. I can agree with that. Are you gonna help me? I need to think on that. Oh. <laughs> well, all right. Think. What are you making now? I'm making a pass system for the coins, so that each coin will fall into a certain compartment. 
Look, this will be the first phase. To make sure the coins pass one by one. I need to measure here. Huh. Yes. <laughs> See? Two coins won't pass. I can see that. Continue. Sammy, at least select three coins for me. 25, 5, and 1 cent. Yes! I'm going to need them now. And I'll set this piece aside. Hey, Sammy, where are the coins? Here they are! Now I understand why they need to be sorted. It's hard to find the one you need. Phew! That's right. Now, can you imagine how many coins a vending machine in a crowded place processes in a day? For example, in a library or in the subway? You can't do it without automation. So, it's better to do some work once, and then it goes smoothly afterwards. Look, each coin will have its own little window, and they will fall into their own little compartments. Perfect. Little windows? Oh, make them with your signature trick. Well, all right. And hop. Voila. Now let's glue the sidewalls to make sure the coins don't roll away. <laughs> I still don't get it. How will it work? Here, look. See? Only the coins of a suitable size can fall into the opening. Oh, now I'm starting to get it. Well, all right, Sue. I understand how the coins will be sorted, but, uh, how will they get into the coin tunnel? We won't push them with our hands, right? Oh, no, no, Sammy. The motor will help us with that. We're going to connect it to the battery with the help of wires. Guys, be very careful with the wires. You'd better ask an adult to help you at this stage. And to make sure we can turn the motor on and off, we'll connect this switch to it. Right. Wire goes here, and that one there. Ah, done! Now we only need to glue a small screw to the motor to create the effect we need. There. What effect? A vibration effect. Look! Oh, <laughs> it's jumping wild! So, will this help the coins get into the sorting tunnel? <laughs> That's right. Let's hide our mechanism into a cardboard case to keep it safe from damage. We'll glue the motor here. Carefully. Watch out for the wires. And the battery goes here. And walls all around. Yes, Sammy. Thanks. Huh. And you've been saying that I'm not helping you. You had a piece with a hole in it. I removed it as a faulty one. Oh no, Sammy. It should have a hole. It's for the switch. So please don't throw that piece away. Here. Um, look. It fits perfectly. Like this. And we'll cover it carefully. Okay, done! Sue, Sue! This has to be the trash, right? Weird pieces, leftovers, I guess. Sam, Sam, wait! No, these are very important. We need to set our case with the motor on these legs to allow the coins to fall down. See? Oh, uh... Oh, I'm just out of shape. Confusing trash with parts. Oh. Cheer up, Sammy, and bring the rest of the pieces, all right? But don't throw anything away. Will do! And we have made this structure. We only need to add the walls. Cardboard pieces delivery! Oh, wonderful, Sam. Now we're going to make the finishing piece. Which piece? Well, the containers where the coins will fall in. Vending machines store all the coins separately to give out the change very quickly. Oh, I see. Tell me, Susie, do all vending machines sort coins by size? Well, that's the basic principle. But modern machines can distinguish coins according to the metals in them and even the images on them to exclude any errors. But our sorting machine is a very basic one. So it'll sort coins only according to its size. <laughs> oh, but it's still really awesome! Oh, Sammy, could you bring me the stickers for our containers? Just a moment! And I'll connect our sorting mechanism. I'll be quick. 
Ta-da! It's not ta-da without decor. You know that. Oh. Move aside, make room for the professional decorator. Sammy, maybe I should do it. You know, neatly. Well, fine. I did a lot today already. All right. 50 cents. 25. 10. And one cent. And on off for the switch. Is it ta-da now? Yes! Ta-da! <laughs> Start the machine! Let's place several handfuls of coins in here. Perfect. And click. Wow. They flow like a river. Oh, yeah. Look, look. They're sorted correctly. That's awesome. Now all the coins in the house will be sorted out perfectly. Will you keep it under control? Yes, ma'am. Will do, ma'am. <laughs> well done. Guys, was it interesting for you to learn how coin sorting happens? Give a thumbs up if it was. And subscribe to the channel to learn more interesting facts about our world. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.